Uh, we're very confident in our preparation. We've, uh, you know, it prepared extremely well. We've uh, been consistent with that preparation. So um, we're, we're expecting to go in here and handle business and, uh, you know, bring a W back. Anything about St. Ambrose specifically that the defense is keying on the good matchups in that one? Well, you know, they're uh, traditionally a strong team. Um, they got some bigger guys. Uh, so they're going to be a lot more physical. And, um, you know, we're, we've prepared for that. And so, you know, going to this game, we have a mind frame that, you know, where it's going to be a physical game and it's going to be a battle. It's not going to be an easy win by no means. So, you know, we're just preparing ourselves mentally for, you know, what we're going into and, and we're ready for that. How confident is the defense as a group right now after the, the start that you've had this season? Uh, we're very confident. We know that, you know, we're going to be challenged and faced with, you know, things this season that, you know, we're going to have to overcome. But, you know, right now we feel like an elite defense and we're going to keep that level of confidence going as well as with that preparation. And I think things are going to play out for us very well. And you're spending the whole season with that number one ranking with that target on your back. Do you embrace that? Um, well, I don't really think about the number one ranking, man. You can't really, you know, you know, get that stuff into your head. You know, we know that we're number one and we got to go out every day not just on Saturday to prove it. So we got to, that, that, that's Monday through Friday, you know, we prove that, you know, we're the best, but you, know, you don't really think about it. You just go out and, you know, do what you're close to do, honestly. Do you guys have a couple games under your belt? Uh, yes, sir. So far this season, uh, have you developed an identity yet with this team? Like, what's this team, you know, Looking like, I guess, so far. It's well, we, we definitely had a good bonding uh, opportunity when we had the trip to North Dakota. So that was a, a great opportunity for the guys to really kind of uh, create, you know, that new identity for this year's team. Uh, we're definitely explosive uh, on both sides of the ball. I think uh, we got great potential, you know, but, you know, right now it's going to be about, uh, you know, just not overlooking anybody and just, you know, staying focused on one week at a time and not trying to look out too far ahead because, you know, sometimes when you do that, you know, things don't go always as planned. So, you know, you want to deal with things one thing at a time and just slowly move along and hopefully we'll find ourselves in a good position in, in the year. As you're losing some of the dudes you guys lost last year, how nice to see some, some of the people that you guys have seen step up so far? Oh, it's great. We got a lot of young talent stepping up and it's just like it reminds you that the coaches have been doing their job recruiting good guys, you know, so you know, you got some freshmen that come in very talented. You got some sophomores that played a little bit last year and now they're back and they're in bigger roles. So it's great to see guys develop. You know, I was one of those guys at one point in time, you know, so you know, I, I encourage guys when they get the opportunity to make the most of it, you know, just like I did. So, you know, it's, it's a great thing to see. And um, I think uh, we're going to be, you know, surprised by some of the performances coming up by some of the younger guys here soon.